Hello, in this video we are going to configure restaurant in POS. Here yeah, I am on my POS. Now going to settings. Here I enable is a bar restaurant. After enabling this I got table management. Now enable this. Suppose if I want to configure floors then I click here. Here is my floor plans main floor and patio here we can see the table management seats of a table and the shape of the table now we are going to the open my new session bar Here is my PO session for restaurant, main floor and the patio. After that I am going to products. Here I create my product. Burger and enable is POS form product. and add price of a burger 20 rupees after that I create some products for bomb mm, like cheese it's storable which is used in burger add on hand quantity for a burger for cheese like I add 10 quantity of a cheese here we can see on hand quantity of a cheese then add veggies is also storable product add on hand quantity for veggies like I want 15 quantity now add sauce Sauce is for zero point five rupees. Add on hand quantity of a sauce. And burger base. Twenty burger base. Now going to the POS product form and create burger structure. Add component like sauce. veggies and burger base and save it
now going to the POS session for a restaurant suppose I want to book my table number 5 on main floor and click here click on burger where is my burger here is my burger add customer here is we can see our receipt and close the session after that we can see the quantity of my bomb product like my wedges are going to 14 quantity of my sauce and the cheeses that's going to the PS product form and I'm going to edit it first of all going to set to draft suppose I need two cheese to make my bur one burger and Batches in five quantities, and then I'm going to save it and then confirm. So here we can see the quantity available for my product and for my sale of my product. Again, going to the POS session. Table number six in patio. My product burger. I want two burgers. Add customer. Here I can see the quantity of my product has been decreased. We can also check from my products like my cheeses are going to decrease. I have only on on hand quantity of my sauce only two veggies and all now going to the dashboard and then settings we are going to enable restrictive negative stock product after enabling this we are unable to book my order when products are out of stock let's check here's your mover bar add table add product suppose I want three burgers then it will show the products are out of stock thanks for watching this video